So Createch have been involved in lots of challenging projects where we've used robots to get into very hazardous environments where people cannot enter. Through this we've discovered that there are lots of occasions where human senses, vision and touch are very important to the operations. So through this project Createch have developed two technologies. The first is Overseer. Overseer allows a greater situational awareness by combining 3D information and wide field cameras for the end user to be able to see beyond the workspace. The other technology, Haptic Master, uses a novel feedback system to allow the user to feel what the tools are going through as they're being used. Key benefits for both of these technologies is to allow the user to feel that they're in the environment doing the work. Overseer provides a 360 camera view which provides a sphere of information as well as the 360 LiDAR. The 360 LiDAR is fused with that camera data, so where the two align, you can get depth data as well as colour data. So the Haptic Master side of the project integrates two robotic arms, one at Oxford and one here at Cockermouth. The operator moves the robotic arm at Oxford and the one at Cockermouth replicates that motion and at the same time the user is able to feel the forces and the torques that the robotic arm here at Cockermouth is feeling and therefore essentially replicating that force feedback or that force sensation for the user to have a better idea of what is going on. This week we've been testing the system here at Cockermouth together with the Overseer project and we've been testing it for a very specific use case which is plasma cutting. One of the major successes was using audio in our feedback of our control. Having the Overseer providing audio to Oxford has allowed the people in Oxford to control their robot with confidence. So today here at uh, this demo we're testing the system between Oxford and Cockermouth which is around 30 milliseconds of lag uh, in the network that we're using. We've actually tested the system before with up to 400 milliseconds of lag so we've actually covered quite a large span and that would mean that we would be able to uh, operate the system from here to New Zealand. So we've actually tested quite a variety of lags and, and it seems to be robust. Aside from being robust to network lags, this haptics technology is unfixed to a specific robotic arm. We've also tested this system with other robotic arms, such as the universal robot. And this allows us to do force scaling and as well allows us to implement different types of controllers, such as admittance control. So Overseer is designed to be one sensor pack. So you can take off any existing sensors that are providing similar type of feedback such as a PTZ camera and replace it with an overseer and it's a plug and play system. It interfaces with IRS so the setup is minimal. Once the system is operational you get provided all that data to your IRIS VR viewer out of the box. This whole system is built upon IRIS uh, ability for us to build robotics very quickly with minimum software engineering. This then opens up a vast range of opportunities for us to deploy these systems in the future, whether that be in areas such as mining, undersea or even space. Overseer has been designed to be applied to any application that works in a remote environment, whether it be oil and gas, nuclear or even domestic operations. The 360 data that it provides on the holistic overview is applicable to all applications. So obviously the next step for this project is we want to integrate with other systems, perhaps people who are working in hazardous environments, bomb disposal, nuclear, uh, areas like this, and therefore we can do some good early trials to show the benefits of this system in operation.